quite a quick video on DHCP name protection, which protects a, a machine's name from being overwritten with the same name during DNS dynamic updates. So essentially, you've got one machine, let's call it laptop, and you've got another machine called laptop. It won't overwrite the one which is already in there. So if it detects the machine's DNS A and pointer records already existing when the DHCP update occurs, they will fail on the client machine who was trying to use the same one. So it just kind of protects it and it protect, prevents, helps prevent client and server spoofing and name corruption. So it, it's kind of quite a useful one, but it's not one on by default. So to switch it on, we just go to our DHCP and we click down and we're going to enable it for IPv4. So I'm just going to go to our properties, our DNS, and down here we can see name protection. So I'm just going to configure I'm going to enable name protection and it gives a little bit more information about what it does. I'm just going to press OK and OK and I've now got name protection enabled. OK, right, that's all for today.